This is Mickey Lynch. And Alan Larkin grabs hold of him there, but the referee waves on the play, gives the dirty man the advantage up to John O'Leary. And Brian Mullins has gone back to try to cover up. O'Leary in now in towards Tom. It's a goal! It's a goal! And a great goal! A great goal by Sean O'Connell! Sean O'Connell facing it beautifully. The pass went into Tom McGinnis before we could get McGinnis out. The ball was set in the net by Jerry Sean O'Connell. And so after 22 minutes of play, Jerry Lee by one goal and two points to Dublin four. And this is putting it up to the champion. This is Brendan Kelly now. And John O'Leary gets the ball from the rebound, his shot, and it is a goal, a goal, a goal for Derry, deflected in there, I would say, by John Doherty. Between them was, it was John O'Leary who sent it into the net, but the ball was in a mix-up between Sean Doherty, the fullback, and Paddy Cullen in the goal, and Derry lead again. Two goals at two points, the Dublin six points after 28 minutes of play and the champs will have to put up their champion socks if they're going to do something about this I see plays pass to Tom McGinnis Tom McGinnis for Jerry going up Brian Mullins intercepting Anton O'Toole again plays out now to Tony Hanahoe and a whole shot half locked down and nicely and very safely held there by Tom Quinn. Going out to the ball, Georgie Wilson. Full of heart, this little man. And Jimmy Keezy grabbing the ball now and sending it high and sending it over the bar. And the sides are level again. Down to Bernard Brogan. Jimmy Keevey and Tom Quinn. Keevey up now to Antonio O'Toole. Anton gone through. It's a goal! Antonio O'Toole, the wandering Anton, who heel there and everywhere, was in the right spot to take the pass from Jimmy Keevey and crash that one home, leaving the score now. Dublin 1 9, Jerry 2 2. Oh, way out to the left, and Teddy Riley, all alone. Not for long, but he's still alone. He's making sure that he's staying alone as he wanders in with that ball. David Hickey, lovely tip down there to Tony Hanahoe. He's on the 21-yard line, the 14. Where's he going? And towards the goal. It's saved by John Summers. It's knocked out to Anthony McGurk. And Anthony feels it out along the far side of the field to Jerry McElhenney. Jerry going up the field with the now. Go to hand one. There are loose men all around him. He's going it alone. He takes his shot, and what a shot, and what a point. The score now 1-9. That's 12 points for Dublin. 2-3, that's 9 points for Derry. And there are about 9 minutes gone in the second half. Brian Mullins coming away now for Dublin. Tony Hanahoe. Bobby Doyle. Still Bobby Doyle. Still Bobby Doyle, and he has taken a shot that's deflected round the post. <laughs> and poor, poor Bobby. And here's Peter Stevenson starting a movement. Gets the ball back now to Tom McGinnis. His pass intercepted there by Teddy Riley, who's having a real Teddy Riley game. And what better could any man have? Anthony O'Toole pushed off the ball there. Bit of pushing going on there. And the ball comes out to Pat Dogerty. In now to Tony Hanahoe. Tony Hanahoe getting ready to take a shot. He takes it and he buries it. Dublin two goals and ten points. Derry two goals and three. Tony Hanahoe was not being tempted into taking a shot when he wasn't just ready. He made very, very sure and he stuck it in the back of the net to put Dublin into a 16 points to nine lead. The scorer, his only score so far, Tony Hanahoe. About to take the kick. And away come Gary. Anthony McGurk. Sean O'Connell and Sean Doherty. Sean O'Connell's licking it out, but gone back to cover up for Dublin. Georgie Wilson 
who got a knock there. The referee gave him the benefit of the whistle. Gail Driscoll up now to Tony Hannahol. Anton O'Toole, and it's a goal! Anton O'Toole, number 15, a pass from Tony Hannahol and sent over to uh, Anton O'Toole for Anton's second goal of the game. Dublin now leading 3-12 to Derry 2-7. Bobby Kelleher. Nicely intercepted by Jerry McElhenney. Peter Stevenson. And here's the chance now for a goal. Brendan Kelly going through a shot and a goal. A goal, a good goal. A good goal scored by Brendan Kelly. 3-12 to 3-8 and just over three minutes left of the game. If that goal had come five minutes to go, what a hectic finish we'd have. The game is over. The game is over. Dublin have won with the score.